Relief is on the way at some point for those millions of families affected by that infant formula shortage. The FDA commissioner told lawmakers today things should be getting better in a matter of days thanks to new steps announced by the Biden administration at a committee hearing. The FDA commissioner said the Abbott plant in Michigan that in part caused the shortage will be back online within the next two weeks. There you see the commissioner adding that with invoking the Defense Production Act and flying formula over from different countries, the supply should be increasing in a few weeks. And here in the Bay Area, we are hearing firsthand about the shortage and the anxiety it's causing. Crown Force Teresa Stasio talked to one woman about her struggle trying to track down formula for her newborn. Oh. I just fed him, so he's oh. in a food coma, as we call yeah. it. Yeah. Meet seven week old Ken, super hungry like most babies are. His mom, Yuki, is supplementing breast milk with formula. Recently, the hospital supply ran out, and that is when she and her husband discovered what many are facing these days. Buying formula is a gargantuan undertaking. My husband and I went to Target and didn't find anything. I mean, I found some of the Enfamil one, but it was the one with Simlac, and I didn't find it. So I was like, oh, maybe just this store. So the next day, I think I asked my husband to go to look for it, and then he probably went to like a different stores, like a four or five stores, and I didn't find it. So I was like, what's going on? And then now I went to Amazon to order it online, and then it says like a one to two month wait. Yuki wow. says in online chats, she is also hearing horror stories. Seeing like whenever someone finds like the supply at Costco or like somewhere else, like they started posting the pictures of it. So I guess people probably go to the store to find them. So yeah, it's crazy. Yuki shared that all of this just adds to the already complicated role of caring for a dependent infant. Really connected to their survival. Like if we cannot feed our baby, like it's really critical. So we really need it right now. Like we cannot wait for it. Yuki says she feels bad so many others are dealing with a shortage in the meantime. She says her fingers are crossed as she and her husband continue to search and find necessary supplies for Ken. Um, Mother-in-law was able to find some online, but it's uh, the similar one, but it's, it's not the exactly the same one, but uh, similar to it. So like she actually sent some to us. So for now it's fine. But <laughs> now like after like, you know, after we're done with those cans. Like, I don't know, like, maybe hopefully we can find something. Teresa Estacio, Crown 4 News. Uh,